Now, from Kansas City's breaking news leader, this is NBC Action News. The man who killed four people will spend life in prison without the chance of parole. Within the hour, a judge handed down Javante Anderson's sentence. A jury found him guilty of the murders of Precious Triplett, her boyfriend Andre Jones, and her two young nephews, Amir and Gerard Clemens. Naja Sherman was in the courtroom during sentencing. The mood in the courtroom this afternoon was extremely tense, but that tension quickly turned to tears as friends and family awaited the sentencing of a man described as a cold-blooded killer. Javante Anderson will spend the rest of his life behind bars. He was uh, received the maximum sentence on all 10 counts. And to give you some background on this case, in March, a Jackson County jury found Anderson guilty on all charges in connection with the murders of his ex-girlfriend, Precious Triplet, her boyfriend Andre Jones, and her two young nephews at a Raytown apartment back in 2009. Now, he did spare the life of a toddler that he fathered with Triplet. That toddler was found wandering among the bloody bodies in Triplet's Raytown apartment. But today, the nightmare for the family is finally over. I spoke exclusively to Anderson's father, and even after the sentencing, I spoke with him immediately after that, and he was still in denial. He believed his son is innocent. I feel a relief. Uh, uh, my son didn't commit, didn't do the crime, so I'm not worried about it. He'll be home soon. That's you all I had feel, to say. Yeah, you still feel like he's innocent. He's innocent. Closure, yes, it's closure for me. You know, the sooner the better. It's closure because, like the woman said, we can't bring him back. We cannot bring him back, so it's closure for me. I accept that closure, but. The family says that they are ready to start uh, their new life and move forward with things, but they do feel that justice has been served. Reporting live in Independence, Naja Sherman, NBC Action News.